Hey guys, so it is Saturday and I'm headed to Hobby Lobby because I'm trying to get some 50% off Christmas decor. <laughs> um, I need black garland for my tree and if they don't have it, luckily at home is really close. So, um, yeah, I'm trying to tuck the little pieces of hair in because I didn't feel like doing hair today. It's still just gelled up under here, but it looks a little like <laughs> crazy when you really, really look. But I'm wearing this shirt that I got from the thrift store. Um, it's from the brand Soul Angeles. So it's like S-O-L instead of L-O-S. But <clears throat> yeah. Wow, doesn't S-O-L mean sh out of luck <laughs> but um yeah they still haven't brought my christmas tree they were supposed to bring it yesterday and it's still not here so i don't know what they're doing but it almost feels like because it's the weekend they just want to postpone it until monday but I hope they would just, or I wish they would just, you know, be honest about that and say it'll be here Monday instead of saying, you know, it's out for delivery ever since yesterday and it's still not here. But, um, yeah, I'm about to get the baby dressed, take him to my mother's house because it's like really kind of crazy outside. I don't want to be driving around with him. Um... <clears throat> because the drivers have just got like 30 times worse because of homecoming so yeah i'm gonna leave him home while i run here um what else do i need to do i think that's it yeah i think that's everything big lots has a sale too that's ending today so i might go there but that's in like a totally different direction so yeah but i'll talk to y'all when i get out and about so i've been looking around um there's not much to choose from as far as like all black decor but i found these i think these are really nice but i'm not really loving the center because i feel like that's bringing like a beige element into the tree um so i'm probably not gonna get these as cute as they are i'm just gonna leave them here um but i did find a door wreath hanger um i found these this is like a clear color so i feel like this is pretty acceptable i mean i'm gonna have white lights on the tree so i feel like that'll add some little you know glitz to it and then i found these long like ball ropes and basically i'm only getting those because they're half off so like four strands of that will be twelve dollars so i don't feel like that's a terrible price well i decided to come to at home just because I know they have a large Christmas section. Um, so while I'm doing this, I'm just gonna peek in here and see. They have nice stuff in here, but <laughs> I wish it was at Hobby Lobby so it could be 50% off because I'm not feeling these prices. Um, I can't find any of the Black Garland and I know I'm probably just going to have to order it online because they barely have anything black. Everything is like red and green. Yeah, 
I like these. If I was going to incorporate white into the tree, I would get those, but um, I don't really want to. I'm not about to pay $30 for a tree skirt. And I don't even think I'm doing toys this year. Like, my son's cool with just getting, like, activities <laughs> instead of actual toys. So, yeah, I'm not about to go too deep with tree skirts. I'll probably get this one if I had to pick one. Because it has, like, you know, the silver, but it's, like, all black. Y'all, isn't this cute as a tree topper? <laughs> I know it's a little overboard, but like the star ones always get crazy. It looks like this one will be more stable because it has like, you know, the little round base, but yeah, I don't know. I probably won't get it, but if I change my mind, I'll come back. I have to record this for my son. I know he would be trying to run through this if he was here. <laughs> this one is hilarious though. <laughs> like he has a brain freeze hey guys so um I still only got that one bag of stuff from Hobby Lobby and that was $21 it's so crazy how fast money goes like I got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 eight of these things and four of those strands of um the black balls and um i got a over the door like wreath holder and then i went to dollar tree and got some ornament hooks it's like it's so crazy how christmas is just like expensive for no reason like the tree was already pretty much a hundred dollars and now it's like you got to add on to the tree too that's why i'm like man i'm not buying all these toys i'm sorry like maybe it sounds mean or whatever but i mean i'm still gonna spend the money on my son and we're still gonna you know do fun things but i'm just not about to like go out here trying to buy all these toys because it's like come on and I know people will probably be like, well, you know, you could have bought the toys and not got the tree. But for me, like, I feel like having a tree is just the biggest part of Christmas, kind of. <laughs> I don't know. It's crazy. But, yeah, long story short, he has a bunch of toys already. So he's never going to be without toys. So, I mean, it really doesn't matter. I would rather him be without new toys for the moment. And that's not going to last anyway, but um, be without new toys for one day. I mean, his birthday is like a couple days after Christmas anyway. So if you really think about it, he's going to get toys. But um, yeah, I'm just trying to minimize some of, you know, the clutter basically I still need to spray paint this easel <laughs> my mother's probably so tired of me spray painting stuff I'm tired of myself spray painting stuff but it's like everything you find that's really a deal and really what you want is never the right color so it's like that's just what you have to do when you're a smart shopper <laughs> you have to you know make alterations to stuff i'm so mad that i left hobby lobby without buying um this jumbo yarn or i don't know what you call it but i'm gonna be making a video probably i'm not gonna make any promises but um i saw a video of some people making like a really big blanket and it looks so cute so now I want to make one but it depends on the price of the yarn because like if the yarn is the same price as me just going buying one of the blankets <laughs> then I'm not gonna do that I would rather just buy the blanket than spend the same amount on the yarn to make it 
guys so i'm home um i actually spray painted this easel i did it silver just to like test it out if i don't like it in a couple of days i'm just gonna go ahead and make it black but <laughs> i went with silver for right now um i'm just showing y'all this is the garland for the tree and well i shouldn't call it the garland but what is it called mm, i don't know decoration for the tree <laughs> now this isn't going to be like a filler but i feel like it'll be a cute little addition because i have all black ornaments um so i have four of these just so they can you know kind of stretch they were 5.99 but um because of the sale they were only 2.99 so i got four packs of those and a bunch of these little i don't even know what to call them icicle type decorations but <clears throat> yeah i'm really looking forward to this black tree hey y'all <laughs> like why do i have on lipstick and going for a walk i don't even know like my plans were um a little bit different but then i was like nah let me just go and take a walk real fast so now this is the result like freaking workout clothes and lipstick because I didn't feel like taking the lipstick back off but um I shouldn't even let me just turn back around because I was about to walk like down the street but it looks a little iffy out here like it may be raining within the next few minutes like it's really gray so I don't know. I'm just going to try to stay near my car. Um, yeah. Y'all know I bought like a wig the other day, but I still haven't worn it out the house. So it's funny. Like, I don't know. But I'm trying to wait for a special occasion. This reminds me of New Jersey, the music. So I'm just trying to get my little steps in. I think I only had like 400 when I first started. So I'll probably do like 3,000 or 4,000 and then just go back in the house. <sighs> what is this mellow mushroom? I have to um, try their pizza. I still haven't tried it. But Anyway, um, I'll get off and talk to y'all once I make some progress on this walk. Okay, y'all, so I'm finished taking my little 3,000 step walk. Um, I didn't do a long one tonight because it's too cold for that. Um, and all I have on under this is a sports bra, so I'm not about to really get cold. I just thought I was sick like last week, but I wasn't. Um, but yeah, I'm not about to really get sick out here trying to get... see black and blue. Hey guys, so it is Monday. <laughs> I had to think about it, but yeah, it's Monday and it is 322. I don't know why I'm just like getting up, getting ready to go somewhere, but, um, <clears throat> I want to go somewhere. So... I don't know, I might not be able to not um, get this gym membership back because the gym is like a place to go when there's nothing to do. And I don't know, I need to just cut it out because when I have the membership, then I don't want to go. But then when I don't have it, I'm like, oh, I need a gym membership. Like, I don't know what's wrong with me, but um, I think it's just like the, the little always wanting what you can't have thing even though i can have a membership but it's like <laughs> wanting what you don't have basically um because it just expired but anyway i just got my christmas tree finally and it's crazy because they were like five days late with the tree but they were like oh if we don't get it there by the second then it'll be free 
But of course, I got it before the second. Today is the 31st, it's Halloween. I need to take off this little thin coating of nail polish that remains on my nails like in the <laughs> middle because like it's basically gone. So let me go ahead and do that. Yeah, so I'm gonna lay right here and do that because I keep putting it off, but I keep being annoyed looking at my nose. It's so funny because um, when I was pregnant or like when I first had the baby or whatever, my hair and nails grew so fast. Like my hair, I feel like was the longest it's been in <laughs> a long time when I first had the baby, but um then of course the whole postpartum shedding thing happens and that just like makes your edges fall out so it did like it didn't really look right um because it was like okay your hair is long but you don't have <laughs> edges so that's why i cut my hair before then i let it grow back put a perm in it and now i'm cutting it again so now it's back to being like an inch and a half long but i'm i'm fine with it i've cut my hair like what five times now i think so i mean i know what it, it'll be back but i'm just talking about the rate that it used to grow when i was like just having the baby um but they say when you have boys your hair grows and when you have girls your hair doesn't really like they like i don't know mess your hair up or something i don't know it's so funny because like when I was pregnant, my son's father and I really were like, oh, we want a girl. But now like I just can't even imagine having a girl. Um, And I'm glad that I have a son. It's funny, like the older I get, I feel like I'm kind of turning into my mother. It's so funny, like when I'm like yelling at the baby or whatever, I say stuff that she used to say to me. <laughs> And it's so funny, like, I used to hate when she said this to me, but now I'm, like, saying it to the baby or whatever. Um, it'll just be little stuff like, um, you know, go to bed or whatever, like, like, when I'm getting on him, I'll be like, now when you fall and bust your head, like, she used to always say that to me, like, when you fall and bust your head, <laughs> Y'all, I had wine, so don't mind me. I'm going to be, like, a little goofy in this vlog. But is my elbow ashy? Okay, no, it's not ashy. It's just black. Because <laughs> I just put some lotion on it, but it still looked like it was a little... What is this? I just I just changed the sheets on my bed. um, So they're a little bit linty still. Well, at least I got this polish off my nails. It's 3.30. I need to be hurrying up. Um, getting out of this house. I don't even know what I'm trying to do. I guess go for a walk. Because what else is it to really do? I mean, I could decorate this tree, but I don't know. I didn't put on as much eyeliner today. I know it's so funny because it probably looks like I put on an excessive amount of like eyeliner, but <laughs> I just like it. Like, but I know that um, technically I'm kind of putting on too much, but I didn't even line my eyes today. Like I just kind of did mascara the normal way, but I usually like um, intentionally get it like on my eyelids and then like go around it and shape it. But whatever today is really gloomy if y'all can tell like it's really like gray out the windows y'all probably can't tell but i need some sort of jacket to put on because i just washed it and it's like still wet so i can't put that on y'all i want to go back to charlotte so bad because it was really like my vibe out there like it was really 
like the people seem more pleasant um i know i don't probably always come off as the most pleasant person but i really am like i would rather be surrounded by like people that are in a good mood than people that don't seem like they are and that are like haters or whatever i can't stand that so yeah i really like charlotte um so i would definitely go back it's crazy because it looks like it's really wet and rainy outside but it hasn't rained since i left the house it just feels humid so that's like adding to me feeling hot <laughs> but it's really not hot it's like cold outside technically but whatever um i'm just headed back to my car i kind of forgot where i parked <laughs> some type of way but yeah i just dropped my umbrella but yeah i kind of forgot like where i parked but i know it's on this street so it doesn't really matter um i know it wasn't like all the way down and i know it wasn't like as soon as i hit where i turned in so i know it's like in the middle <laughs> um sometimes i feel like dory <laughs> if y'all have ever seen the movie finding dory then y'all know what i'm talking about but yeah um i have one in north face so and i have my fanny pack under here so that's why it looks like super poofy I feel like it's kind of helping me sweat, so I kind of like it, but I don't know. Now I feel like I'm going to have to throw this in the um, washer when I get home because it's going to be like super sweaty because it's kind of acting like one of those <sighs> sweet sweat bands or whatever. Like I feel like I had one of those on wearing this, but... <laughs> Yeah, I'm almost back to where I started. Well, not really, because I have like five more blocks to walk, I'm sure. But it feels like a really good workout. Y'all see me in a reflection. <laughs> but yeah, um, it feels like a really good workout. because this piece looks the longest um the directions are really like vague they only have this one little sheet and they don't really have like okay this is part a b or c or whatever and i know it sounds like common sense like i'll oh, just put the big one at the bottom but i'm just looking like okay is this right um but i'm just gonna you know roll with it and do what I've always done and put the large one down at the bottom but there's actually four pieces and not three I'm used to it only being like three pieces of a Christmas tree so yeah we'll just see how this turns out but so far I'm loving the black color like it's always kind of annoyed me to have um a green tree <laughs> and I know that sounds probably weird, but 
it's like okay there's nothing else green in my house so why do i just have this big centerpiece of green it's like and there's nothing else green in here today is actually halloween um i think that's why i was able to find this color tree because i was trying to look for this months ago and i couldn't find one but this is technically like a halloween tree but i want it for christmas so um yeah i think that's why they were like in stock and stuff so like y'all see what i'm saying like these two look like almost the same size but one is like a little bit shorter so this one over here is a little tiny bit shorter so i'm guessing just put this one on next and keep going does this even fit in here though like see this is weird because now it doesn't slide down into that one I'm like, I mean, is it upside down? Like, it's, it's crazy. Yeah, see, this one fits in. Now, that's weird, but. Okay, well, let me just stop talking because I'm just going to do some music in the background. <laughs> So this is taking so long. <laughs> I feel like I've been doing this for at least 40 minutes. Um, I still am not done with the bottom layer, but it's getting, you know, way better than it started out, obviously. Um, I have to like get up at the top and fix it. Y'all can't even see up there, but like, I'm probably gonna like bend down that really long stick that's at the top because that always looks weird to me. But um, yeah, I'm still finding little areas like over here that I have to fluff out and stuff, so. But yeah, I'm just gonna keep going. I'll come back once I'm done with this bottom layer and then, I don't know. I don't really wanna put too much up there before the lights because I feel like the lights are supposed to be deeper in and then the ornaments are supposed to be like on the surface, so. Yeah, today I might just be putting up the actual tree and then I'll wait for the lights to get here and stuff. Okay guys, so I am done assembling this tree. Um, of course, I don't have the lights and everything, so I can't really decorate it tonight, but that's fine because I'm tired from <laughs> just assembling it. It took longer than any other tree has ever taken but this is the tallest tree i've ever had um it is 7.5 feet so yeah i'm like down here i'm five four and a half so yes yeah, definitely up there but i wanted like a really tall tree this time um i feel like i always get a tree that's like right here and then i'm like I don't know. I don't want to feel like I'm the same height as the tree. <laughs> so, yeah. But I'm definitely happy with getting the black tree instead of green that I'm used to. And I feel like I wouldn't have liked the white tree. So, I feel like this one just goes so much better with 
my decor in my house. <laughs> I thought I was gonna feel gothic, but it's really not like that deep. But I am going to put all black decorations on it. I don't even know about those silver things that I bought from um Hobby Lobby. I don't really wanna add those on. I just wanna have like all black. I feel like that will make it look more cute. <laughs> So I'm about to spray paint these because I can't find any black ornaments. Um, I know they have some, but um, like decorative ones, I don't see any black ones. So I had the idea to just spray paint these because I have used these like two years in a row with them being this color. So I don't feel bad about <laughs> spray painting them now. So I'm just laying them on the backs first and then I'm gonna flip them over and do the fronts. So I finished spray painting my um, ornaments <laughs> and um, it was a really annoying process to be honest just because I feel like the spray paint is a little old so I feel like it doesn't dry as fast. Um, so I feel like the process took like an hour but I did have to do like the back and the front so I had to like do one side and then wait for it to dry and flip it over and do it again so that's what made it seem like it was taking forever i'm sure it's now I'm waiting for the lights to arrive tomorrow they were supposed to arrive a few days later but now they updated the actual date so they should be here tomorrow i had to order ones that have like a black string instead of a green string or a white string because i have a black christmas tree now so, yeah, y'all know like when you <laughs> upgrade or update stuff, then you have to get all the little accessories that go with that thing. So, sometimes that's why I understand why people just keep the same stuff forever. Because it's like when you update, you have to just start a whole process of like reestablishing everything. I want to go somewhere to eat soon. Not tonight, but I'm going to like go to a different place. So I've been trying to figure out where I should go. I already went and ate breakfast the other day, but I'm probably going to go to like a dinner so I could actually dress up because I want to wear my wig. First of all, I really kind of like my wig. It's not like, you know, top of the line or anything. The wig was like $30, but I like it. Um, And that's all I need. Like, I feel like that's pretty, you know. <laughs> for a person that doesn't really wear the wigs often um i feel like that's okay Hold so on. did i tell y'all that i like lance gross now <laughs> i always try to find like who is my celebrity crush because i really don't have one but right now i'm really feeling lance gross i've never like i've seen him before and i never felt like that but now for some reason i'm like He's so cute. I think because now he looks a little like more muscular. I'm gonna try to research later tonight. Find me a cute little place to go have dinner alone. <laughs> Why am I so silly? But yeah, like go have dinner. Um, get cute. It's so weird like getting dressed up for yourself, but whatever that's what my mother has always told me like girl just you know do whatever for yourself like because me like i'm the type of person where i'll reserve all of the little fancy stuff for like when i'm booed up or like when i have company or like for example if i get like bath and body works candles i won't burn them when i'm just alone like i'll wait <laughs> I'll like wait until I have some kind of romantic guest or whatever because I just feel like that's a waste to like buy a more expensive candle and then you just aren't even like nobody's really gonna see it besides you I don't know I know that's like bad or maybe a toxic trait or whatever you want to call it but um yeah, I just feel like 
um, certain things. Like, if I have a really nice outfit, like, I won't put it on until I'm, like, going out. Um, so it'll just be, like, sitting in my closet, and I'll just dress like this, like, you know, um, active wear type stuff until there's a reason. I don't know. I know it's some other people like that. Gina Janine says she was, you know, kind of like that, but she's trying to break the habit. Um, because I watch her vlogs all the time. But, yeah, like, I've just been like that for years where I just keep all my good stuff until, like, there's somebody around to see it or, I don't know. Like, it's not low self-esteem or anything because I don't have low self-esteem. I really value myself and I know I'm like the shit. But um, I just, I don't know. I think I'm like so considerate. I'm like overly considerate to the point where like I'll make sure that other people are enjoying stuff and then I'll be kind of putting myself on the back burner like oh no you know I don't need that I'll just use the cheap one or I'll just you know so I don't know what that is but I promise y'all I don't have like low self esteem because I know like I'm that girl so but anyway I'm not conceited either, y'all. That probably just sounded conceited. But I'm like a perfect balance between the two. Like, not conceited or stuck up. But also, don't have low self-esteem. I'm like in the middle. Um, I should have parked right there. So, I was just listening to the radio. And the guy on the radio was like, oh, you need to, um... <laughs> And I'm, I took it personal because I'm like single. I'm about to take this thing down because now all it's doing is creating shadows and being in the way. Like, yeah, let me just cut it down. And it does that every time I go over that loud train track or that crazy train track. Yes, I keep scissors <laughs> right in my... um car door but you never know when you'll need scissors like this is so hard to cut off all right i'm just gonna cut the little string because it's getting on my nerves um oh my god i always come down too far and then there's no more parks left <clears throat> oh, so I was listening to the radio and I took it a little like personally <laughs> because the DJ was like, um, y'all better find somebody because it's almost cuffing season. And I'm like, why do people really have like this mentality like, oh, I have to have somebody right now? First of all, it seems really backwards to me because I feel like these like months right here I turn on my heat I turn on my heater in the house now I don't know about y'all but I would rather be booed up when I have the AC on in the summertime so I don't get why everybody's like oh cuffing season it's gonna be cold and all that like I have a heating blanket <laughs> or a heated throw you know um some pajamas some fleece flannel <laughs> like and I would just prefer to be alone like when it's cold so I could like bundle up by myself like I get the whole you know concept but I don't because it's like when you're in the house you're gonna have heat on um so doesn't it make more sense for cuffing season to be like in summertime when you have the AC blasting and you can really like get cozy I don't know. Maybe maybe I'm just tripping, but um I don't get it. I'm so glad I'm almost home. I made more than what I was, you know, 
supposed to make today so technically I did good but I was just a little irritated because I drove so far and didn't make anything but um it's fine okay guys so I just got my Christmas lights um I had to order these with a black string since I have a black tree um it comes with this little remote to control them these are how the lights look they're really small but i feel like it'll be fine like this is how the um receiver looks and yeah i hope that these just you know stretch <laughs> all the way across that big tree so i'm about to put them on because then i can decorate the tree with the rest of the stuff and we'll see how it turns out okay so Y'all can see the entire tree is pretty much lighted at this point. And then I still have all of these. <laughs> so this was, you know, a really good amount. I'm, of course, going to put these in the tree too. But I just wanted to show y'all, like, how covered it already is. Like, I would be cool with it being that many lights if I just, you know, only had the hundred dollar i mean hundred dollar the hundred light version but this is the 200 light version so i feel like this is like still half um so if you guys want to order that i got them from amazon they were about i think 24 dollars but um i don't know i had some sort of discount or i think it was like a 50 percent off discount code so yeah I think these are really nice and like classy. They're not like the big, you know, old school bulbs, but I feel like this is gonna give it like a more upscale look. I'm just really excited about the tree. <laughs>